will show you how to tie our new ladies ties. You can tie them many ways and with the reversible ones like this one you have even more variations. With the reversible tie I pick the side that I want to show. I want the brown one and I'll make a simple loop. With the reversible tie I pick the side that I want to show again. I pick the pink one and I tie a simple four in hand knot. It's good to start at the end of one side, like this. Baby, it's not right It's not right, no Going insane Got a problem to fix, can we face it tonight? Face it tonight, oh No way So today I'm going to show you how to tie a tie and I'm going to teach you how to do the half Windsor knot. So if you want to see how to get this look, just keep watching. Okay, so I have my tie here. So step number one, position your tie. So we want to position it with the narrow end going down about halfway the length of the wide end. So I have my narrow end here, wide end. So we can see we're pretty much centered. Step number two, the wrap. So I'm gonna take the wide end of the tie and cross in front of the narrow end and wrap it around the back. So now I have the wide end of the tie on my right side and I'm looking at the back side of the tie. Step number three, the triangle. So to create the triangle, I'm gonna take the wide end of the tie up and back down through the loop. and I'm just gonna kind of snug up that triangle. Okay, so it should look something like this. Step number four, the bridge. So I have the wide end of the tie on my right side and I'm looking at the back side of the tie and I'm gonna cross this in front of our triangle and I'm going to bring it under and through the loop. Okay, and we're gonna take the wide end of the tie and it's going to go down through the bridge. Just like so. Step number five, finish. So I'm just going to adjust my triangle and with both hands, I'm going to pull the knot up the neckline And just make sure everything is nice and snug and exactly how you want it. Now um, for the back side here, this little part of the tie just goes through the little loop there. Okay, so that is how you tie a half Windsor knot. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you have any questions, just leave them in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching and I will talk to you later.